the criticisms came swiftly and brutally. Within 20 minutes of taking the mic, social media erupted with comments mocking Brady's delivery and cadence. One user quipped, Tom Brady ain't stuttered this much since he told Giselle he had one more year in him, a sharp reference to Brady's brief on retirement in 2022, which coincided with his high-profile divorce from supermodel Giselle Bündchen. Fans noted that the very skills that made him a master on the field, his composure, precision, and ability to perform under pressure, seemed absent in the broadcast booth. Instead, what viewers got was an uncomfortable, stilted delivery from the NFL icon, with one fan even stating, Tom Brady finally found something he's terrible at. A major point of contention was Brady's analysis, which many felt lacked depth and energy. Comments like Tom Brady can't seem to form any sentences that have any sort of normal cadence to them and Tom Brady just said it's hard to make 10, but really hard to make 20 yards. That's what $375 million worth of analysis gets you folks, reflected a growing sense of frustration from fans who expected more from a player of Brady's caliber. For some, Brady's commentary was simply boring, with one critic stating that his voice was not pleasant to listen to and that he needed to be hella interesting to compensate for his lackluster delivery. What made the situation even more difficult was the shadow of Greg Olson, whom Brady replaced as Fox's lead analyst. Olson, a former tight end for the Carolina Panthers, had earned praise for his energetic, insightful, and engaging commentary during his tenure. Fans were already feeling the loss of Olson's lively analysis, and Brady's faltering start only heightened the backlash. Social media was awash with calls for Olson's return, with one fan bluntly stating, Damn, Greg Olson way better than Tom Brady in the booth, while others lamented Fox's decision to demote Olson in favor of Brady, a rookie in the broadcasting world. Sympathy for Olsen's demotion was palpable, with many questioning Fox's decision to rush Brady into the top spot without giving him time to adjust. Yet, not all reactions were harsh. A few fans acknowledged that Brady's nerves might have gotten the better of him and that he deserved more time to settle into his new role. Tom Brady does not sound comfortable in the booth just yet, one user posted, noting that this was Brady's first game as an analyst. However, even these more forgiving fans echoed the sentiment that perhaps Fox had acted too hastily in bumping Olsen from the lead role. Brady's future in broadcasting may be uncertain, but one thing is clear, fans were not impressed by his debut. While his skills as a quarterback are undeniable, three-time NFL MVP, five-time Super Bowl MVP, and owner of countless records, translating those talents into engaging, Fluid commentary is another challenge entirely. The road ahead may be long for Brady, and with the Super Bowl awaiting him at the end of the season, the pressure to improve is immense. Tom Brady's legendary status on the field is secure, but his journey into broadcasting has proven that even the greatest athlete can stumble in new ventures. The fierce reactions to his debut have sparked questions about whether Fox's $375 million investment will pay off, or if Brady will ultimately retreat from the booth. Fans who idolized him on the gridiron are now watching to see if he can adapt to life on the other side of the camera, where quick thinking and sharp analysis are just as vital as they were when he commanded the Patriots' offense. Time will tell if Brady can bounce back from this rough start, but for now... His debut has been a sobering reminder that greatness in one arena doesn't guarantee success in another.